Hey guys, welcome back to the plateau, and today I'm bringing you yet another Pokemon tutorial video. So as you can see, we have our lovely, here hold on, yeah, our lovely 2DS here that is about to die, but as you can see, here we got the bottom. And you can see, for those of you who know what a homebrewed 3DS looks like, ours is indeed, oops, one, one too far, homebrewed. So, in order to do this, which the this I'm referring to is Gen Pokemon, in order to generate your own Pokemon, you must have a homebrewed 3DS. Now, there are two methods. I honestly just found out about this one point yesterday and figured it out so it's not that hard so if you want to homebrew your 3ds i will not make a video on that unless i get like tons and tons of requests on how to because there are other better videos out there but to download the software you would need is pk pksm pokemon safe manager it's really easy to install if you know how to homebrew, just look up PKASM, download it into your root folder, or the root of your SD card, which did not work for me actually. I had to um, go to the like 3DS folder, and then you'll have, so I don't know why the root of the SD card didn't work, but as you can see, I got it all set up. So then, click on Rosalina, and boom, right there is your PKSM. Go ahead, click on that, and it should bring up a menu that looks like this. You can already guess what all these games are. It supports from 4th Gen up. So X, Y, Oros, the Sun, Moon games. Diamond, Pearl, Platinum, Heart, Gold, Soul, Silver, Black, White, Black, White 2. Supports quite a bit of games. So, of course, I have Pokemon. I need to fix something real quick. Because <laughs> as you can see, this is not in English. So, I'm going to Options. I'm just gonna click on this little, okay, this isn't working. Oh, do I have to click A and then? Okay, well. I'll, I'll figure it out later. So you can change the language by going to options and then this. It's just not actually wanting to work. So. Oh, that's how. Okay. So I want it to this to be options. There we go. There we go. Okay, I figured it out. Sorry about that. So it's, let me like close out of it real quick. Mm. 
then open it back up. This shouldn't be taking... There we go. So I just had to fix that real quick. Sorry about that. But now you will see this English menu that says Storage, Editor, Events, Scripts, Options, and Credits. Credits are what you think they are. Options, as you just saw, are, well, your system settings for PKSM. Scripts, not gonna lie, no idea what it does. Someone out there knows? Tell me, please. I beg of you. Not really. But actually, do tell me, just. Then you have event. This is the list of all your event Pokemon. So, let's say you want this Mew right here. As you can see, the languages are in Japan. Then you have Overwrite Wonder Card. Go ahead. Um, that's, so, you see Inject a Wonder Card and Slot. So, like, if you were to change that to 1, that's when you would want to turn on that Overwrite Wonder Card. Adapt Language to Wonder Card. Just leave that on no, unless you are doing it in your home, or like your native language. So since it's from Japanese, or Japan, and I'm in America, I would leave it on no, because I do not want to play the Japanese version of the game. So, that's pretty self-explanatory. Took me a little bit to figure it out, but it, it got there pretty easily. So, as you can see, I've already ginned some Pokemon, like this Mew that I showed you just a couple seconds ago. But, there are plenty of different things you can do. One of them being editing your Pokemon. So, you hit edit, you can go to stats, and you can actually change the IVs and EVs of your Pokemon. So I'm just going to hold down this plus button on all of these for my ditto. So that way, when I bleed this ditto, it will have, it will give me some very nice Pokemon. Okay. Yeah, you all have to see my ugly finger. And you probably can't even see the numbers. But I don't have a stylus, so... Tap save when you are done. So, you just hit back. Then you can edit the moves. I'm not going to. You can change its level. Uh, you can change the friendship, nature, all of that. And so when you're done, just click save. Then you can also release it from outside of the game. I wonder what... Oh, no mind. You can clone the Ditto, give you an additional... Like, it just clones it. So, then if you go to an empty space, click... Generate. And by alphabetical order... Or not alphabetical. Pokedex number order thing. I'm not good with words. It will bring up a list of all the Pokemon... In all 807. So you want yourself a... I don't know. I've been shiny hunting in Pokemon Let's Go. So you want a shiny Nidoking? Just hit generate. And then you go to edit. And you can edit it however you want. I'm going to release that however. So that's how you do the edit or edit tour. And then... You also have storage. It's like a free Pokemon bank. It's if you know how to use Pokemon Bank, it's pretty self-explanatory. Um Whoa, that just got really bad. Give it a second. There we go. That's a little bit better. But that's how you use PKSM. Um so if you want a video on how to homebrew your 3DS or if you just not sure what I mean by the root SD card and all that, and you need me to show you how to download PKSM, then I'll leave a 
uh, comment in, leave a comment down below. I do look at those. So, I hope this helped you guys answer some questions, and I'll see you next time.